Ninja Kamari is simply better. Brought to us by Kevin, you know what I'm saying? Now, for this show, I only watched the first episode. Yeah, I think there's like four episodes out now. You feel me? So, I'm slacking off a, a tad bit, you know what I'm saying? But, off that first episode, bro, they was boxing, bro. They was going kind of crazy, but I'm not going to lie. You feel me? So, let's see what I'm Kevin got to say about this series, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not going to lie, bro. I haven't been on a tube in a minute. And, and this man got a honey k now, bro. This man be going crazy. Knew this show was getting added to the roster. Now I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I'm low key enjoying this more than every other anime right now. I don't know why, but watching this feels like. In every other anime. Again, bro. I don't know how to explain. Hold on now, that's a crazy take. Right now I'm watching. I just started for Freyan. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. Uh, show seems pretty cool right now. You feel me? Uh. Hori Mia, you know what I'm saying? That's a romance anime, you feel me? Kind of fire. But, but I'm definitely going to have to start locking in on this show, bro, because the show do look gas. But anyways, this episode gave us a little backstory. Pretty much the Ninja Clan started in Japan. If you're not repping the Red Circle, you are out. But then there was some mm. crazy attack sure like that. and they said, you know what? Maybe we was bugging. We were slightly out of line and deeply apologized for our actions. And from that day forward, they still repping the big JP, but under some quote unquote big greater power. And anyone who disobeys because of this decision is hunted down for the rest of their life. And then we see our boy. Again. Oh, so that's why they people. was hunting, bro. Okay, what is he went? They but doing him crazy. Had some different plans in mind. But after getting jumped by an army of ninjas and eviscerated. Yeah, I'm sure he's talking about. I'm pretty sure he's talking about the second episode because I recall seeing all this stuff. Said army of ninjas. It took a little toll on his body. So then this old man came through with this outlandish ass fit. That man walked out the house with 3D glasses. And you know he a demon too, bro. All old people in these shows, bro, be so cold, bro. Said that shit was swag. Well, turns out he was a doctor. And that one time homeboy stabbed his arm and started tweaking was actually a secret technique. Now, another what? thing I don't understand about shows is why do people choose a secret technique that kills them? There's <laughs> got to be other options. Matter of fact, how do you even train a technique like that? You just learn to move. You and just don't, bro. Work. Yes, bro. Ways, yeah, doctor <laughs> did whatever he did and not going to lie. I need this nigga's worth ethic. The second he woke up, he ain't waste no time. This man would sleep all day. I know his ass thirsty. So then he walked <laughs> up on him. Not a single word exchange and started shanking his ass. And no, that bro. went for the whole night. Actually, Waking up that angry is so crazy. But I'm not even mad though, you feel me? He did get his family killed. I'll probably be on the same timing. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. I'll probably be on the same timing. Fuck the all nighter. That D1 one crash out type. He didn't even want to reuse the same sword. He had a new one for every session. No, he hate him for real. That man looked like a novice. And when he finally got bored, he lit a match and set that boy on fire. <laughs> oh my God. So then he suited up, rolled out, and I'm guessing he went to every <laughs> hideout he knows about. Even to get back. Sadly, all of them were empty. So he went to get himself. Oh God, they lucky. Like when these two cops came through and bullied the bartender. Jesus, hold on. So he went to get himself a little drink, right? When these two she She kind of caked up. It's hanging off the jeans. Cops came through with Jean shorts. Bartender. This cop decided to mess with the one guy wearing an all black hoodie in a corner of the room. Broke the arm straight to the neck. Mm. And the cop should have just let him leave because he hit him with the weed dummy. And he didn't even. Oh hit my him. God. He said, Yeah, I could have gave you the knuckle sandwich or even a mean elbow, but I let you live. But no. Oh, but look at his face, though. Said, cop bro. <laughs> just let him leave because he hit him with the weed Hold on, dummy, bro. And he didn't. Look at this him. man, bro. You should, you should not mess with no one who just hit him with the weed like dummy. has his face and on he, like this, bro. Like, like, bro, he looks so angry, but he looks just like mad at life, bro. Even hit him. He Jesus said, Christ. I could have gave you the knuckle sandwich or even a mean elbow but i let you live but no glaze that was one of the cleanest weaves i seen in anime i know that cop was shit and bricks from his eyes that nigga definitely lagged <laughs> little light flash right for his eyes bro so now we're back to the detective and shorty is on a whole vr i don't know she probably playing like um nah she definitely a rec room demon <laughs> rec room demon but that's when Joe West got a phone call from my boy and they decided to meet up at a Chinese restaurant. So anyways, he sat down and asked him to tell him who's responsible for all the assassinations. But Joe pulled a blick on that boy. 
Now, oh, he must have lost his mind. A mere Glock. He must have lost his mind. Person like this. You've seen the aftermath of the hospital massacre. You need at least the Navy SEALs to handle this man. And the delivery guy still had that is the job. Our military the right there, bro. Getting sturdy. Here to pick up no order. He dashed in trying to take his head off, but he blocked it with a. How high is him ceilings? For whatever reason, cops always try to get in the mix. But me personally, if I pull out a gun and my opponent's weapon of choice is a damn melee weapon, <laughs> yeah, you got it, bro. I have you got no it, big bro. A nigga like that. Especially if I shot at them and the bullets get deflected. That would have been the day I quit. <laughs> and the only reason he's alive is because homeboy stepped in. So they were clashing. They did life. What they banging? Used the damn Omni tricks and became forearms. But that don't mean none to us. Flipped off the table, we dodged those. And look at this. Woo. We we did all that without releasing eye contact too. And our boy said <laughs> now he's he locked in, him, but he got to one up him real quick. That man was rocking a six arm and started working that boy. Call all his weapons, made sure to grip the dome piece for maximum damage. Mm. He was about to go in for the kill, but turns out bro didn't just have extra arms. He had a whole clone. They started jumping, but this ain't nothing new. And Joe no, they West, really banging this show, bro. Run away, bro. You you cannot hang with these two, bro. Just leave, bro. Was perfect target, like bro. Go find some cover. I'm sure fighting mutants isn't in your pay grade. We constantly gotta save your ass. And I never seen someone use the sparks of a sword to create a fire. Excellent. That is crazy. All that. Weave. Oh, double weave on your stupid ass. Oh, triple weave on your stupid ass. Hold up, he need a quick bev. Now hold this majestic destroy flame. Proceeds to stab his hand into the wall, pin his the move head on his body. The move. Oh my gosh. And, with a knife throw. and when you thought it was all over, it Fatality. Was they sorry, bro. There's no way. They shot all these bullets and didn't hit nothing, bro. There's no way, bro. <laughs> There's no way. Some random dude spun the block and aired that bitch out. And this wasn't your average drive-by. They pulled out an RPG and yeah, they blasted crazy. the place. And when the dust Oh, they're in Japan. How do they get a, a freaking rocket launcher, bro? <laughs> settled our boy was nowhere to be found. He's lurking on the rooftops. Next he a demon though. See these I'm not gonna lie. With a collateral. He one of the ones. I'm assuming this is the boss trying to get away. But surprise, surprise, he ain't get too far. Everyone in that whip got their dome piece palmed. And it's not an anime if they don't have these freakazoids. Alright, bro. Alright, bro. He looked like he. <laughs> bro, he. <laughs> okay, he's... Bro, this man is a freak, bro. Jesus Christ, bro. Now it nah, bro, the zoom in and then the freaking lick on the screen is so crazy, bro. What a nice you know he's rock hard right now, bro. Pre come leaking. Now imagine being in the afterlife and you see that you died to a nigga with this cut. Oh, hell Jesus. Hell what do you even call this? Nigga got a street road on his head. <laughs> then it cuts to this guy named the Reaper confronting an exile ninja. That boy stanced up, used his secret art, and the Reaper simply walked through it, hands in pockets and all. Me and homie was saying the same thing. Yo, Look at his yo, face. Where'd your sword go? He looked down. Not gonna lie, even though you the op, that shit was cold. I he had a sword to begin with. I'm not gonna lie. That boy stanced up, used his secret art in the Reaper, simply walked through it, hands in pockets and all. Me and you one of the ones. The same <laughs> thing. Yo, bro, where'd your sword go? He looked down. He one of the ones, bro. I'm not gonna lie, even though you the op, that shit was cold. <laughs> so now we're back to homeboy with the detective, and this is when they confirm their partnership. They pulled up on old girl, hopped in the V, and this went from modern day to that cyber little car. This little car is pretty much a supercomputer. So they researched a company named Aza, who was most likely behind these assassinations. And they find out that anyone who was even a slight inconvenience to the company got taken off the map. Jesus like Christ. The start. Then it cuts to the face of Aza talking to the Ninja Clan leader. And turns out the face of Aza was the one behind that nefarious drive by. And and the ninja leader pretty much nah, I was moving devious. Oh my gosh, don't do that shit ever again. Then it cuts back to gang and they got ran upon. You telling me that supercomputer don't got a VPN? But once again, Joe West disappoints me. If someone is on the road, wait, how did he be fighting them so easily, bro? Like, like, bro. Or why the hell is it getting chased for two episodes right now? Oh, mag in the corner. Obviously, he gone had to step in, sensed his key and stabbed straight through. But the ops has the most dangerous entity as backup, Truckoon. Oh, uh, GG's.
You can't beat Truck Coon, bro. But the fight ain't over. Shot projectiles through the car, leaped out the window, threw some nice of his own, and they got to the move him. straight he banging. Back up, but look at this nigga. Hitting a Kevin Gates <laughs> mid box is crazy work. Okay, good move. Easy block. Don't know who he aiming at. That nigga moved five minutes ago. 360 block for a dab of sauce, but got kicked away right after. Then now, these fight scenes top tier, bro. Oh my, bro. What are the Doc Ox, but the maneuvers were way too clean until he got hit in the back, and he deemed that shit unacceptable. He ate that hoe. After six arms, we going to eight. Caught the arms, but the enemy is no novice. He was dragging that boy through every mm. item on top mm. of that building. Until he shot rockets out of his backpack. When did he even get the on the building? Back, almost getting him hit until he pulled out the sword. Slashed both the rockets in half then got lost in the air. That boy thought him being in the air was free eats. He dodged all of them shits. Threw the knife. Then came back down with a fatality. Jesus Christ, bro. To the edge. Oh my God. Bro, you dragging it, bro. You ain't got to do bro like that, bro. Oh God, you did not do bro like that. Ripped the camera out. Got up close and was like, yeah, nigga, I did that. Emoted and everything. Mm -hmm. Then just broke the camera. Fucking demon. Oh, no got way. Got was like, yeah, nigga, I did that. Emoted and everything. Then just no, the emo's the OD. And then right when he was about to dip, he was getting a phone call from his duffel of trap phones. And it was some dude saying they can now finally talk. Now the emote's crazy, I'm not gonna lie. I don't think I I, I ever seen that before, bro. That was kind of crazy, bro. The emote, bro. After just fatality, bro. That's crazy. He one of the ones. I don't know Brett's name, not gonna lie to you. But he is one of the ones. No cap. Does this have the best story? No, it is any... Well, this, yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. After the story, bro, I'm here for straight action, straight hands. You feel me? But yeah, five video, you know what I'm saying? As always, I'll leave his video link down below in the description, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, and peace.